Hello. Are you waiting for us to come in? Hi guys, today we're in a very special place in Taipei because this is actually an adoption cafe for stray animals. Every animal here at Lang Lang Bia Hu, which translates into strays, don't cry, was once living on the streets, but now they're here waiting to be adopted. And the owners support the animals by selling food and drinks to the public. And the animals can stay here as long as they need until they find their forever home. They also have locations in Taichung and Tainan. So if you're living in Taiwan, there's no excuse for not popping in. Okay, let's go check it out. Cafe is great actually, like as exactly how you said, doing good for these animals who did not have a great start. That's a really good thing. Apart from that, like the cats here, they're so chill. The dogs are like, they greet you when you just stand at the door and stuff and just looking at them playing around, being playful and stuff. It's good to watch. And it's also good to know that this is all not just for show and fun. It's also for a goodwill that if some, if you like any of these pets, you can talk to them and adopt them, which is a really good thing to do. And yeah, food is actually a bonus. But as you see in the video, it looks amazing, feels amazing. And yes, you should, 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 must, must, must come to this cafe. Okay, now I'm going to ask you a bonus question. So oh, la, la. Richie, I know you're a little bit scared of dogs. You've had some bad experiences in the past. How are you feeling about going to say hello to the big dog outside? Well, I will say hello to him. We, we, there's nothing, no, there's no beef between us. <laughs> We're actually good friends. No, but the thing is, whenever any dog, be it big or small, pounds on my chest, I feel very scared because of my past. Like when I was a kid, I had an experience. But, the, well, I'll take my chances. If, uh, if you see me in the videos after this, that means I made it alive. And if you don't, then it was good to see you. <laughs> but no, it's gonna be fun. It's going to be fun. Uh, we'll greet, we'll play some with dogs. Uh, yeah, let's spoil them a little bit and have fun. So you ready? Let's go say hi. I actually really like it. And you know, something we were speaking about just now, when you come to somewhere like this, you kind of expect the food to be a little bit trashy. But actually, the food was so good. I would come here just for the snacks. And it's like really cute because I think all of the animals, like some of them have an eye missing, some are missing an ear, some are missing a tail. So you can really tell that they've not had a good start in life so to see them here trying to find a home and like a lot of people are coming here as well like bringing their kids looking around i think it's actually a really nice place so i would really recommend everyone watching this comes and checks it out So guys, this was the cat and dog cafe. Well, I hope you guys had fun because we had a lot of fun, especially, you know, looking at these amazing friends who maybe are missing an eye or an ear, knowing that there's some people out there taking care of anyone and everyone until they're adopted is an amazing thing to know that the world is not all gone to garbage yet. <laughs> that being said, Hannah cannot say you goodbye because she's the one who's filming right now, but we had a lot of fun and I hope you guys will have equally or more fun when you visit here. The Google Maps link, the name of the cafe and their Instagram are all in the description below. And please don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. It's actually a tongue twister if you say it three times faster. Anyways, that's all for today guys. Hope, you to, hope to see you guys soon and yeah, see you guys in the next one. Ciao, ciao.